automatic transmission, pressure control regulation with a pressure control solenoid. Flow from the oil pump enters the pressure regulator valve and applies pressure against the spring. When the force on the valve overcomes the spring force, the valve moves to the right, which opens the exhaust port. This releases some of the pressure back to the oil pan. This causes the pressure to drop slightly. When this happens, the spring can close off the exhaust passageway. This repetitive process is used to regulate line pressure. Adding pressure to the boost valve compresses the spring, which makes it more difficult for the valve to open the exhaust port. This causes the line pressure to increase. Modern transmissions all use pressure control solenoids to control the position of the boost valve. The solenoid is controlled by a control module. The control module uses an on-off technique called a duty cycle to control the position of the pintle, which ultimately controls the flow of fluid through the solenoid. Pressure control solenoids are often called PC solenoids, line pressure solenoids, or EPC solenoids, which stands for electronic pressure control. Line pressure is fed into the actuator feed limit valve. Regulated pressure is delivered to the pressure control solenoid, also known as the PC solenoid. The control module sends a duty cycle signal to the PC solenoid. Unwanted pressure is returned to the oil pan while regulated pressure is sent as a torque signal to the boost valve. The boost valve position is directly related to the regulated line pressure. By adjusting the duty cycle to the solenoid, amperage flow is controlled through the solenoid. Amperage flow through the solenoid directly impacts the position of the pintle valve in the solenoid. Controlling the pintle position through duty cycle and amperage flow impacts the fluid flow through the solenoid.